I see everything. That's gonna be that's gonna be hard to explain. I'm trying to I'm trying to sit I'm trying to I'm trying to sit here. You saw it too, Flip. You saw it instantly. And see, imagery is everything. Imagery is everything. I'm trying to let that sit right there because I want to give her and the so-called sister a chance to explain themselves. There's some basic need to be talked about. Imagery is everything. Anything you do, but you put a black face to it, a black person, you know what I'm saying, to it, it's powerful. Did the girl say her name? Did, the, did her friend put her name out there? Rainbow something, they said. I don't know. But we want to talk to her, too. She was so uh, angry. You know, she 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 was so angry over this white woman. You know, we just want to calm down and have a respectful conversation and see where everybody went left at. I also know I used, I used to bang. Hey, yo, we ain't, we ain't going for the flim flam, yo. We, we ain't going for it. Let me say, Brent. First of all, she's sitting on a queen size bed next to an old file cabinet with a bear in the bed with granny drawers on. All right, she can't uh, help he herself. Did, so he did it, Flip. Zeno did it. Zeno did. Zeno she can't did help it. herself with granny draws on. So I like black people. See, the problem is All these right. platforms are so dope. Are so dope. They want to be on your platform, Flip. They want to be on your platform, Bread. But instead of just being natural, they want to force themselves and say, "Hey, you don't let white people on your platform." No. It's just that the people who are watching these platforms don't necessarily want to hear what a white person who is forcing their way in the culture got to say. What just happened, what just happened was a disgrace to our whole community, and it amplifies why the f I've been banging on here so hard. We got a going to work, and she getting pimped out by a woman from the LGBT community. God damn, I see everything. Don't make me go get. Don't make me go get a uh, 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 Reverend Breadloaf up in here. I see everything. Nah, it's not time for Reverend Breadloaf. Yeah, he gonna go crazy. I see everything. She sat you there under her, in your underwear, in your panties, and made you roll her blunt. Yo, I was tapped in when when Flip canned up the white woman. Flip immediately. Yo, what's up, Brad? What's up, Zeno? Flip immediately said, Yo. What's good, Kenfo? Flip immediately said, Yo, I remember you. You're a racist, right? Instead of her stating her point or tapping into the subject, she tried to use the black woman as, as, as a get out of jail free card and show that uncomfortable. Her body language was, was, was speaking values. The black sister was uncomfortable, half naked on the bed, and she canned her up without her consent with a smirk on her face to show like yo i got a token this right. that's what you call tokenism right. i gotta get out of jail for free card so so all i'm saying is right you know what i'm saying it's not even about her it's about the bigger problem of white and black all right we're not gonna make it we're not gonna sit here and talk about her all day and give her the attention that she wants because she's corny she's corny and she wants to be done all right all right she got her five minutes she got her minutes enough with hell and see you later it's the bigger picture of these white people that come onto these platforms and want to be down and get upset because they're not cammed up and they're not a part of the conversations. And, 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 and you know, like, that's the same thing with hip hop. That's the same thing with everything. It's not like we don't want to be down, but for Jesus Christ, this is our platform. Let us live and, and, and just watch it, be entertained, gain some knowledge and just assimilate naturally. Cause nobody owes nobody owes them nothing. Nobody owes them nothing. They owe us. And believe me, this is not racist. This is how it is. A lot of them feel like they're upset because they can't be down or they're not. It's not about that. But whatever you bring to the table, make sure that you bring it in a way that our people, the people on the platform, relate to it. And that's all it's about. We understand that cultures are all different and there's no problem with assimilating. But you know what? If you're gonna assimilate, take on our struggles. Preach to your other racist friends and racist people our struggles and our problems. All right? Don't come on here and want to be down with it, but then go on the other side because there's always other side of your coin in your life. And then you got all these other racist around you. Our platforms are black, right? And because we do comedy, and this is why I'm doing a big blog on this, because we do comedy, they think that because you do comedy, that you can't talk about black issues. 
that you can't talk about black issues, and that's the problem. With right, people. right, right. I've been you, told that. They, 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 right. they, they, because you do comedy, you suck in the top, and you're doing a little stupid dance, the giddy up dance with your hands to the side and, and exactly. following an, an invisible horse. Look this, look, this is the problem. This is the problem. This is the problem. Pay attention, Flip. I keep the receipts. Now see, now see, y'all think y'all think that motherfucker just be out here playing, right? When when y'all making room for people to antagonize your community, they, That's crazy. they uh, it's it's called white supremacy. It ain't got nothing to do with uh liking your products, look. It ain't got nothing to do with uh trying to Number be like you, look. 